Vaggy, I'm getting worried. He is not in here. I can't find him anywhere. It's been two weeks and still nothing from him. What if something bad happened? <laughs> you don't have to worry so much. I'm sure he will be perfectly fine. Don't you think he would have come back or told us something by now? Hey, take it easy, honey. If it's important <sighs> to you, I will help you find him. <clears throat> After all, it's Angel we are talking about. He can take care of himself. Yeah, you're right. So, did you bring me what I asked you? Don't worry about that. I have what you're looking for. Unfortunately for you, our agreement changed. I know very well who you are, Angel. And my people doesn't like much the snoopers. They won't be happy knowing I have contacts with our rival boss's son. So I'll have to take risks. I want to be rewarded. Or someone who shouldn't know will heard of your betrayal. First of all, I'm not cheating on anyone. I'm done with my dad and his fucking business. Anyway, mind your own sh** asshole. Don't you think you're so tough, bitch? The game here follows my rules. As you know, nothing is free. So if you really want this photo, you have to reward me properly. If you understand what I mean. You don't leave me much choice, douchebag. Do a favor for me, bastard. Try not to show your shitty face around here for a while, would you? Mm -hmm. <gasps> Thanks for the help, but I think I'll take this. Hey, Angel. Glad to see you back from your night out. We are just watching a film. Wanna join us? Not tonight, princess. See you tomorrow. Weird. <sighs> I'm sorry for how things have been between us, Molly. But no matter what, I'll find you. Those bastards will pay for what they have done. Charlie! It's a pleasure to hear from you. How can I help? Something wrong with the hotel? Maybe somebody who disturbs your business? No, no, Al. Nothing of that kind. The hotel is fine. Not much different from the usual, to be honest. I called you to ask for your help for a different problem. Since you offered your support at the hotel, I thought you may help me with this. You see, it's been two weeks since the last time I saw Angel, and he never came back at the hotel. He may be in trouble, so I was thinking if you can help us find him. I'm not really inclined to find out what that disturbing creature has been up to, but I have to admit I can't deny my love for a good hunt. I'll see what I can do, dear. Great! Thank you, Al. I knew I could count on you. If there are no clues at all as where he has been or what he's doing, it'll be a difficult task to find a starting point for this search. The last time I saw him was when he came back from a night out in one of his favorite nightclubs. You can start from there. I think it's called Angel's Paradise. You know I don't trust him. Come on, Vaggy. I know he's not the most reliable demon in hell, but he seems willing to help. I think that's a good action from him. Hello, miss. I've been informed that Angel Dust has been here recently. Is there somebody who could have some information about him? I don't know anything about him, but if you are interested, there is somebody at that table who might know something. I'm sorry for the unexpected intrusion, but at the reception, I was told to ask you for any information on Angel Dust. Is that right? You. So sorry, where are my manners? I'm Alistair, pleased to meet you. I would like to ask you some questions if you have nothing against it. I was commissioned to find Angel after his disappearance two weeks ago. Have you been in contact with him recently, or maybe you'll have some useful information to find him? What f problem is my asshole brother stuck in now? Brother? I didn't know Angel had a brother. He never mentioned you. I don't think he talks much about me. 
He still refuses to speak to me, and sincerely, from how things have been between us, I have nothing against it. Our characters are way too different. Other thing is with Molly. They have a special bond, and since they are twins, it was kind of predictable. However, I know absolutely nothing of this bullshit he's doing. I cannot help you. I will have to use other methods to find him. And how exactly you think you could find him? Oh, no need to worry about that. I'll just have to ask for some favor of some old acquaintances of mine. It seems that I still have to ask once again for your help. But don't worry. Your effort will be lavishly rewarded. You will have many souls to torture and devour. I can guarantee you that. Now go! Follow his scent and find him. Hurry up, uh, Antonio! I'm not as fast as you, Molly! I know it. That's exactly the reason why I love running so much. And don't call me that way! How? Antonio? Now I can't call my brother by his name. You know very well that only Grandma can call me that. For the others, it's just Anthony. Isn't it strange that every time we come to visit our grandparents, we always come here under this old tree, since I can remember? Don't you see what beautiful view there is from here? You can even see the farm! Wasn't that the place where you found that sweet little pig last year? Finally! Ah! Al? What are you doing here? Charlie's searching for you all over hell! You better come back to the hotel before getting in more trouble. What's new? It really seems they can't live without me. Probably you have some sort of value for Charlie. Thanks for the clarification. You know I don't want to run after you all over the city. I have better things to take care of. I've been instructed to keep an eye on you. It would be preferable if you don't undermine the hotel's reputation again. I have to take care of some unfinished work. Private affairs. We wouldn't want your personal problems to become our problems, would we? At the hotel, the business has been slow lately, so it's important there won't be other problems in the future. Do you understand? Hear me out, Smiles. I won't come back until I decide so. Fine, then. As partner of the hotel, I have to assure you won't mess around. Interesting. This can become really useful. May I ask why are you sitting in the street like that? Well, nothing important. Just work. I don't give a single shit if you have some private affairs. If you aren't earning a penny standing there, then bring your ass to the studio and make up for the money you owe me! Maybe with Al, I'll have the possibility to ignore Val's orders, just for the time I need. Standing here won't help, so we better get going. There's still many things to take care of. If you had to keep an eye on me, you better know the whole story. Maybe you can even help me out. Who knows? I visited so many assholes and still nobody gave me any useful information. So, we haven't much to work on. I am not here to help you, Angel. Yeah, yeah, sure. Yet, here we are. Hello, 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 one and all! This is your vocal chameleon here to tell you all about our Patreon. If you'd like to support us and all the content we'd like to bring to you, then our Patreon is the way to do it. Follow the link in the description to help us out and get a load of perks, from joining our Discord to joining us on streams. We've got song downloads, ringtones, and even ASMRs for those who want us more... Hmm, intimate interaction with some of the characters we voice here. <laughs> we know you're growing curiouser and curiouser, so fall down the foxhole and join us for a mad time. <laughs>